The assets and actions of the Philippine Coast Guard took front and center earlier today at the Alalayan 2023 exercises that featured, among others, search and rescue efforts, putting out fires at sea, search and rescue operations, anti-illegal drug search and seizure, and human trafficking response. BTV's Patrick De Jesus tells us more. A blast of water cannon can be seen from the deck of the BRP Malapascua. Then it approached a ship on fire to hose down or put out the flames. This is just one of the simulated scenarios at the first Alalayan Exercise 2023 held earlier in Manila Bay and led by the PCG National Coast Watch Center and participated in by other government agencies including the AFP, Bureau of Immigration, BIFAR, Bureau of Customs, the PIDEA, and PNP Maritime Group. Other simulated scenarios include anti-narcotics trafficking operations and response, goods and contraband smuggling, and responding to human trafficking. The aviation helicopter of the Philippine Coast Guard also showcased its capabilities in conducting aerial surveillance that helps during search and rescue and disaster response. The PCG clarified the maritime exercise has no connection to the recent incidents in Ayungin Shoal where Chinese Coast Guard used water cannon against ships and supply boats of the Philippine Coast Guard and the AFP while doing a resupply mission for troops stationed in the BRP Sierra Madre. The Alalayan 2023 exercise has been planned three months before that aims to measure interoperability among different agencies in responding to maritime incidents. This is not a show, of course, of course, of course. Uh, this is just a, an exercise to test our interoperability among the, the, the different uh, support agencies of the National Coast Watch Center. There's really no uh, uh, no uh, secret message from this exercise. Just that we, we, we want this to push through especially at these times when yung ano natin yung weather natin is uh, palaging uh, ulan and it's good to have uh, to have it on a on a fair weather the PCG said their water cannons are to be used exclusively to put out fire incidents at sea although they can be used multi purposely pwede ring pantaboy pero hindi pa naman natin na ano yan, na encounter yung ganyang ano situation. Some instances siguro, extreme instances. For example, may mga gulo sa dagat. But uh, if wala namang gulo, bakit natin gagamitin yung water cannons? Should be put to good use lang. The Alalayan 2023 exercise was also made possible with help from the European Union Critical Maritime Routes Indo-Pacific or EU Crimario, such as the Indo-Pacific Regional Information Sharing or IORIS a proprietary communications platform in monitoring maritime incidents. Um, I've spoken with uh, some of the officials here who said that the, the platform does uh, fill a gap uh, that was existing beforehand in order for these uh, agencies to cooperate. So uh, yeah, I'm quite impressed to, uh, to what I've uh, seen today. Patrick De Asus for The Nation.